All right, another day in the crypto world, but not a bad day in terms of Bitcoin and everything kind of pumping. It kind of rides along the stock market, which had a pretty good day today, and the last five days have been pretty good. But here's what I want to warn you guys. They're always going to find something, okay? So I want to show this right here. Crypto firms Genesis and Gemini charged by SEC with selling unregistered securities, all right? Gary Gensler has found somebody else to go after. And it's no surprise that this was gonna come up. They're still in this whole XRP issue that's been going on, but there's always gonna be somebody. This is the same Gary Gensler who was having conversations and meetings with Sam Bankman-Fried forever. So he knew all about it, he knew what was happening. And if he didn't, shame on him, even if he didn't, right? But they were looking at FTX for the longest time and never once thought about charging them with any security. So interesting how this kind of plays out. But I do want to say this. With this type of news, you would expect Bitcoin to tank. You would expect crypto to tank, the whole entire market. Well, let's take a look at the market in terms of Bitcoin. Because as Bitcoin moves, so does the market. And we're looking right over here. We're sitting here just under 19,000. It did cross over 19 briefly today. But it doesn't care. Bitcoin doesn't care. The market doesn't care anymore. They can come up with news after news. Now, if Binance was being investigated or had some issues or you know something similar to FTX, I mean, that would have been painful. But look, at the end of the day, the point is there will always be some kind of news, some kind of headline that's supposed to take you down a path of shaking your confidence and your conviction in the crypto space. And if you don't have it already, it's going to solidify that even more. And it wants to put you in a position where you stay on the sidelines, where you continue to sit on your hands. That's not the case. Don't do that. You are going to potentially ruin your financial freedom or the chance of financial freedom. So the news is always going to be out. There's always going to be something negative. You've got to look into it. You've got to do your own research and ask yourself better questions. Why are there so many intelligent, well-connected, wealthy individuals who are coming into the space in droves? Ask yourself that. Why are there so many institutions that are piling into the space quietly? Some more quiet than others, but they're coming in here. So ask yourself these questions and really pay attention to the answers that come up with proper questions. So look, there's always going to be some issues. Tomorrow the market can go down. Bitcoin going down to 17,000, 16,000. It does not matter. It's the principle behind it, not the price point that's valuable. I want you guys to focus on that and we'll see you in the next one.